Good morning. Today is Monday, March the 27th, 2017, about 7.50, and it's 55 degrees. The sun is up. It was seven years ago today that Loretta passed away. Mary's off to Hardy's. I lit a fire just to take the chill off the house. We'll let it go out because it's supposed to be 80 today. Larry called and he had a nail in his tire in the Silverado, so he took it on to get it fixed. So I came out and watered these plants for him. That dogwood there has been blooming a long time. Larry spilled coffee on the clothes he wore to Hardy's this morning, so I'm doing a load of laundry before the coffee thing steps in. What you doing? Getting ready to change the oil and filter in the lawnmower. Okay. It's that time of year again. Yep. Got to get it done. Get it done. Larry, oh, I took the filter off. Changing the filter. Larry had to take this cover off before he could get back to where you drain the oil. Yeah, we'll make it simple anymore. Yeah, push in and turn counterclockwise. And then what? Then you pull out. Here it comes. Well, it was... Does it, need, does it look dark like it... Yes. Oh, it's still draining just a little. Got the new filter screwed on it. 64 ounces of oil. He already put one container full in. 48 ounces. Yeah, perfect. You got it. Now he's got that, that much um, old oil to recycle. I'm out here at the kale patch. I found the recipe. I'm going to try cooking some for lunch. I cut my second container of kale and a colander full. Now he's taking a break waiting on lunch. I've got my green peppers and onions cooking in the skillet. I put in about, it's about half of a green, big green pepper and a small onion. I added my chunks of chicken to heat. My peppers and onions are still cooking. I just dumped my kale in there and added a little water to kind of make it steam. And put the lid on for a little while. And this is all done. We'll see how Larry likes it. How I like it. I added some salt and pepper to it too. I cooked the asparagus in the microwave for a minute. It's just those five little pieces we had cut. Got some grapes for dessert, black seedless. There's the kiwi plant we planted the other day. I didn't show it to you um, after we put the dirt in around it. But if you look, right there on the end of that little limb, there's a little green leaf started. So it's going to grow. The older plants have leaves on them already, bigger leaves. Our poor fig tree still looks as bad as ever. And there's the saw again. Must have more work to do. Well, the washer's done, so I'll put the good things in the uh, dryer and hang the jeans out on the line. Got the two pair of jeans hung out to dry. There's a problem with the clothesline. It broke. I got the jeans hung back up on the second line. My fingers just don't work like they used to. Tied the clothesline back together right there. So it's fixed so I can hang clothes out again. Oh, it's better than it was. It's tighter. <laughs> My glass man just came. He's going to replace our big window there in the front. The pants is off the line. Okay. He's taking out the old window, or the new old window.
He's out there making some adjustments, it looks like. There goes the glass man. All done. I got a nice new window. Now he put some fence wire up there by his cucumber so it can climb on it. He's kind of rigged it up there. There's our load of lambs that I need cut off. There's our little pile of firewood we got out of the limbs that Larry cut when he trimmed the tree. He trimmed the tree back to let more light into the garden so the beans will grow better. Larry found fire ants in our planter, so he's treating it. We got the rows all made, and Larry put the fertilizer down in the holes, and now he's filling it in. I pulled all that out so I could put the fertilizer in. Now you can go back with the 
seed planter, hopefully. I might plant the whole thing. Yeah, we'll plant it. Want to plant the whole row? Yeah. Skip a couple of them. I might have to go back. Now you got to keep the front wheel down, but it won't come out. Push down up towards the front wheel. That's it. You got to go. Just go straight. You're going off the road. You got to go back to your right. Go ahead. Now you're straight. Just go straight. See the beans coming out out there? Yeah. Push down a little harder. Okay, that far is worth it. That's good. You have to pick it up so the beans don't come out. And that's right. Then come Where's down the next that row. row? Huh? I put on my fancy veil because of the uh, no seams and gnats. Oh. I'm just thinking, what should we eat for supper? It's four o'clock. I don't care, roast beef and anything thaw out. Yeah. We got baked sweet potato. That's fine. I love beans. You've got canned beans. Then you buy 20 canned beans. Oh, you beans. mean pork and beans? Oh, no. green beans. Um, you think you bought about. Yeah, I can have green beans. Eight or ten cans. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Maybe another month and onions will be ready. Now he's going out to uh, chop up leaves so he can mulch them. And uh, I had him put a kerchief over his nose because all that dust gets down in his lungs and throat and makes him cough so much. He kind of resisted but for a while, but it, when he first came around, he had it on top of his head instead of around his nose. <laughs> I think he did that just to make me fuss at him. These are some of my yard sale bargains I got when I was shopping with, when I went with Betty Saturday to a yard sale. A cute little snowman and saw one thing. But I like snowmen, so I'll put that out at Christmas. And I got this handy dandy cheese crater, grater. Uh, it was, see, that was a dollar. This was 50 cents. But it does all kinds of grading. And it's got the tray for it to go in. There's another back there. I haven't quite figured out how to put it together, but I will. I got all these spatulas free. And then the wood spatula, and we use it for stirring paint. And I got a book of The Wisdom of Abraham Lincoln. A lot of quotes from him should be good. This is Larry's spot after they took out the cyst a week ago. So this is after one week. It's healing pretty good. It's just black and blue everywhere. Today was the day I was supposed to pull the stitch out. Of and I did. We got roast beef for supper and green beans and sweet potato. And Larry's having his roast beef in a sandwich. And I think I'm going to get a pickle to go with mine. Now he's back watering the garden. It's 7.23 and the sun's about down. I've got a lot of footage to go through and edit, so good night. God bless.